episode 7 Ace Restoration. Uh, you're probably wondering why we released two videos and then just dipped out entirely. So I'll give you a quick update. So the power in my house, or the furnace in my house, actually shorted out the power to this garage and fried all the wiring. So it took me a little while, but I just bought myself a generator for now. I'll fix it for real in spring. So let's just do a quick update of what's to come. So I finally finished up uh, cleaning up and restoring the snowmobile hood for a 1972 Olympic. Uh, just scraped all the decals off, all the fucking mailbox letters that old guys like to put on these. Uh, sanded it down, got it yellow again, polished it, and put a tiny little Skidoo logo on it. So that can go back on the sled one of these days, but I'd like to get the sled running before I put the hood back on. Um, gonna get a new front tire in this three-wheeler. It's, uh, as you can see, it's flat. I smoked a rock in about 50 miles an hour and blew out the tube on the inside. So I gotta figure out how to get that wheel off, uh, pop that tire off the beat. I got a new tube for it already. I uh, gotta figure out why this guy's still not pumping water, but that should be a pretty quick, easy fix. I bet you it's just a little clog somewhere. And then uh, the next outboard project is gonna be swapping the heads on these two little guys. If you look closely, this guy has a helical repair and one of the spark plugs on the head, and I don't like that. This guy is just shot, it's used up. Someone was, uh, someone was using it as a parts motor so if you look it's missing a lot of the electronics underneath the flywheel which i don't want to replace it's got a weird different lower unit on it it's, it's just missing a lot of shit i don't feel like fixing it but it does have a good head and this one had this one's a good motor so i'll put the good head on the good motor we'll see if we can get a nice running five horse out of it um i mean other than that we still got tons of projects to do but those are the ones on the on the front burner right now uh, the other the other new thing here is I picked up a 1946 Evinrude Zephyr, which is super weird because it's a four cylinder, two cylinders on each side. It's opposing four like a Subaru. So this one's going to be fun to play with. I got to pump the gas out of it, put it on the stand, and see what it needs, and then uh, we'll go from there. That's where we're at.